Back in 2015, I released a video explaining the meanings behind these Snapchat emojis. Ah, oh, look at me. So young. So naive to think that they wouldn't add any new emojis. So I'm back, and just to be safe, this time I'm going to go through all the emojis that you can find on Snapchat. Now, I'm not going to title this video Top 10 Secret Tricks That No One In The Entire World Knew About Snapchat, plus tips, and I'm not going to use a thumbnail of me looking shocked at my phone with a red arrow pointing at my phone like, whoa. No, I'm not going to do that. This is a classy joint here, the Definitely Owen channel. Fart noise. Anyway, let's begin. First up, the thing that started this all off, the best friend emojis. How many are there now? Oh jeez, you see, back in my day we only had- First off, the yellow heart emoji. That means that you and this person are number one best friends. You send the most snaps to this person and they send you the most snaps as well. And because I haven't come up with a better joke than the one I told two years ago, I'm just going to replay that. You're probably likely to see this symbol next to girlfriends, boyfriends, and if you're really lucky, the girl you have a crush on. However, that doesn't mean you're in. You still got to work at that. Just because you're best friends on Snapchat doesn't mean you're going to make it in the real world. I'm sorry, but that's reality. Yep, that's the best I got. Up next, the red heart emoji. This means you have been number one best friends with each other for two weeks straight. Sick one. Moving on. The pink hearts emoji. This means you have been number one best friends with each other for two months straight. Here's a tip from me, find other friends. The baby face emoji means that you have just become friends with this person. Maybe in real life, maybe just on Snapchat, there's no way to tell. The face with sunglasses emoji. This emoji means that one of your best friends is one of their best friends too. You send a lot of snaps to the same person that they send a lot of snaps to. I give this emoji a rating of train emoji number four. Beyond pointless. The big smiling grinning teeth emoji thingy. This means that your number one best friend is also their number one best friend. You send the most snaps to the same person that they do. Because there's no better way to get caught cheating on your girlfriend with her best friend than via Snapchat. The smirking face emoji. You are one of their best friends, but they're not one of your best friends. Seriously, what is the point? You don't send them many snaps, but they send you a lot of snaps. Moving on, the classic smiley face emoji. This emoji means that this person is one of your best friends. Not your number one best friend, but just one of your best friends on Snapchat. Coming up next, the fire emoji. This emoji means that you are on a snap streak. Fortunately for me, the 2015 word of the year wasn't snap streak. I swear, if that's the 2015 word of the year, I'm gonna kill myself. Actually, what was the 2015 word of the year? The fine folks at Oxford Dictionaries decided that the word of the year should be an emoji. Specifically, it's the face with tears of joy used when you're crying laughing. Okay, so a snap streak is when you and someone else send each other snaps every day. The number alongside the fire emoji shows you how many days it's been since the snap streak started. The 100 emoji appears next to the fire emoji when your snap streak reaches 100 days. It's down to you to ask yourself if that's something you should be proud of. The hourglass emoji means that your snap streak is about to end, which might not be a bad thing. Go outside, hug a dog. High five a hamster. I don't care. And finally, the birthday cake emoji. This one is pretty obvious. If you haven't guessed it already, it means that it is this person's birthday. However, this emoji only appears if this person has turned on the birthday party feature in settings. Are we done? Fantastic. So those are the current emojis and their meanings that you'll find on Snapchat. So I hope you, what's that? People can customize the emojis. You're kidding. Moving on. You also might have seen a selection of emojis next to the stories from celebrities or public figures. Those emojis show that these stories come from verified accounts. It's basically like the blue tick on Twitter, but just way less elegant. Also, you might have seen these purple emojis next to some people's names in their profiles. Users who have their birthday stored in Snapchat will get a small purple emoji that corresponds with the relevant zodiac sign of the date of their birth. Because that's what we want to encourage, more horoscope readings. Thanks, Obama. Anyway, those are all the emojis that you'll find on Snapchat as of recording this video. The exact time is 27 minutes past four on May the 5th, 
2017. I'm giving you an exact time because it may have well have changed before I even upload this video. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. My name's Definitely Owen, and I'll see you in the next video.